to be on the title. We screen. are live. Can you hear me? No. Well. All right. Here's the title screen. That's it. That's the game we're playing. That's the game we're playing. Hello. That's the video game. Say hello to everyone at home. Oh. All right. Who's going to start? We're starting in uh, classic mode, right? I believe only player one. You know what? That's fair. That makes sense. That make that make that does make sense. So who who are we gonna go through classic mode as? Who are your favorite Smash 64 character? Uh, I guess I'm most comfortable with Mario. Then let's do Mario. I don't really. I don't have. I don't think I've played Smash 64 in years. Well, when I was playing it earlier to sort of warm myself up, here are the things. Oh, uh, you remember. were you were warming up. Uh, not today, but like when we were originally planning. You're gonna be at an unfair <laughs> advantage. Uh, here are the things to remember that I completely forgot. Uh, there's no side special, which I'm sure you remember. Yeah. That would not be added until melee. You also can't charge smashes. Yeah. You forgot those things? You also, you also can't grab items while- It's not that I forgot those things, it's that I'm so used to those being in Smash now. Like, you can't grab items while you're moving. Now that- I don't think that was added until Brawl. Yeah, pretty much. But, like, those things have been around for so long that I've completely fucking forgotten they weren't in the original game. Oh, yeah. Uh, don't worry about that lag. The players aren't seeing Yoshi that. That's just a, that's Yoshi just a, team, baby. That's just a stream thing. The Yoshi team was always very cathartic for me as a child. Because you just beat the shit they, out of wild animals? They die, they die so easily. You like you like just beating the shit out of wild animals. I get it. No, I love Yoshi. Yoshi's a good boy. But sometimes a, an example has to be made. Of wild... Of, like, of harmless animals. I don't think I would call Yoshi a harmless animal. Look, he's not even I've engaging. Seen, I've seen what that dude can do. He's not even engaging. Not even engaging, says the guy who threw a bomb. No, Yoshi's not engaging. I'm engaging. Well, <laughs> that was self-defense. <laughs> that was self-defense. That's okay, we can still unlock Ness. We've already was, unlocked Ness, but it's it's fine. That was beautiful. That was self-defense. We've been mm, genociding the Yoshis. What's the goal today? Play. Pretty much, we're gonna do some run- We're gonna do like one, maybe two runs of classic, play some exhibition matches, mess around and uh, board the platforms, break the targets. If we can get Classic to work for you. If we can, yeah. Oh, we've unlocked all the characters. Because Ness is hard to unlock. Yeah, Ness is surprisingly difficult to unlock, even when you are, like, a Smash veteran. Three, two, one, go! Even though, like, it's... All you gotta do on... on in this game to unlock Ness is... I remember... Fox being like one of the hardest fights in classic mode. Not when you can tech. I hear an item. It's interesting how the camera doesn't zoom out to show the item in this one. That's something that I had genuinely forgotten. I also didn't remember that that was... Oh god. It's like things like that that I'm so used to being in Smash that when they don't happen, my brain's just like. like there we go. That kind of that kind of thing was specifically like. I. I heard the sound for the item, but it didn't zoom out, so I was like, "Oh, there must not be an item." <laughs> that was your like, instinct. I'm so, I'm so used to it. All right, let's see if you fuck up in the same way that I did. How when did you... I uh, played this once. I missed a single target. 
and it was one of those that I could not go back to get later. Because a lot of these, so like this, this and Melee are the only two games in the series where they designed, um, they designed different courses for every character. Uh, because obviously after Melee that started being untenable. <laughs> I would then, I would rather Brawl didn't even have break the targets to be honest. I don't like the standardized one. Yeah. But then like you get to ultimate and making a break the targets course for every character would be fucking impossible. That would take so long. It's it 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 does suck a lot that it never came back. But... By the way, it's funny that Luigi's in this fight even if you don't have them unlocked. Yeah. He's the only unlockable character that's in Classic, I believe. I mean, Ness None is right there. Oh, yeah, but, like, that... Your partner is random. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, I need I need that heart. I need that heart. heart container. <laughs> I was scared Ness was gonna take it. Oh, the ray gun's violent in this game. Did you hear that sound effect? Holy shit! Yeah, I remember that being a really, like, visceral, heavy, heavy sound effect. <laughs> remember as a kid having no idea how to unlock Luigi? Luigi is, like, the most out of the way to unlock. He's the only one not attached to classic mode. He's attached to board the platforms, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> This is the best stage in 64. I will not hear otherwise. Dreamland is a close second. And, uh, Zebus can uh, eat my ass. I remember that first night that we played Ultimate, there was a pop-off when we played this stage. This is a good stage. This is, like, a really good stage. I love it. Ha! <laughs> Get fucked, Pikachu! No character. I was able to unlock Captain Falcon and uh, Jigglypuff as a kid, but Ness, I never unlocked. Luigi, I think I found out on accident. This is also a pretty alright stage. Have you seen the match oh. that uh, was the reason that it got banned in Melee? I have not. It's like Camp Supreme. I, I love that in Jigglypuff's uh, classic mode and ultimate, uh, her final boss is Giant Donkey Kong. Yeah, that was incredible. It, it's amazing. Oh, jeez. It's really easy to rack up damage on Giant Donkey Kong, but actually getting the kill is not easy. That's true, Saffron City was the only Pokemon stage that wasn't just like a generic stadium or Poke Floats until like Brawl. I think Unova was the first one, right? No, because Brawl had a uh, Spear Pillar. Oh, you're right. We just oh, forget that Spear Pillar fucking sucks. I mean, and then in that case, Melee was the only one that didn't have one. That's true. Unless you That's count fair. Ultimate, which a lot of, a lot of series didn't get new stages in Ultimate, uh, but I don't count that. I mean, those stages are still around in Ultimate. Yeah. Except Poke Floats. I really like Board the Platforms. Shit. Oh, fuck. I think I like Board the Platforms more than Target Dust. Well, because Board the Platforms is more of a platforming, like, challenge which really highlights why Smash is so unique. Because you couldn't put this in any other fighting game. I mean, you couldn't put Target Test in any other fighting game either. Eh, not necessarily. Not in the exact same way that it's in, but you could put a challenge where you're trying to break targets. There we go. I like Spear Pillar as a fucking around stage, because I do enjoy when when uh, Dialga shows up, but when Palkia shows up, uh, or when Cresselia shows up, that stage is trash. 
So it is only good when the Alga shows up. <laughs> or when uh, hazards are off. Uh, I don't like it when hazards are off because of that lower section. You need the laser beam to screw it up? Yeah, pretty much. That area needs to be a, a danger to the health of everybody inside of it. Jeez, Kirby team's hard. This is where I'm gonna lose uh, my next life. Probably. Yeah, Kirby team didn't fuck around. They're ready. Except, Except for that one, who just, <laughs> instead of doing an upbeat, shot a single blast and then died. <laughs> Good job. How come you didn't lose your power? You're cheating! Ah, oh, there you are. Almost. You almost made it. No, come on. Come on! Oh! Just throw it. Just throw it. Throw it at him. No, at, at him. <laughs> the Kirby team doesn't have that much uh, knockback. Yeah, but the bat does. That's fair. No, you know the star rod, that's the thing to throw. Samus this gets is a my full least name. favorite stage. Well, actually, no. I think I think Peach's Castle is my least favorite stage Three, in the in 64. Because of those ungrabbable platforms on the side. Fuck that. Yeah, uh, Ultimate made that stage playable. Or did uh, did Smash 4 have uh I, it was DLC in Smash 4, but I don't remember if the, if the platforms were grabbable. Yeah, I, I, I knew it was DLC, but I couldn't remember if it had grabbable platforms. I personally hate this stage. Now we're talking! This is fair. Into the, into the acid. I do not understand... a map screen on Zebus. Wait, what? Is it? What? This character being in this game is really fucking weird. Considering Metal Mario was only a thing, like... Two years prior to this game. I know, out. but it's so cool. The fuck that fucking sound effect too. Yeah. Ooh, perfect. Or not. Or, or the least perfect it could have been. <laughs> I forgot how the physics worked on that. It took the bumper out for a while. Is it in ultimate? Yeah, it is. Okay. I believe melee. I think this is it. This is it. There we go. Because it was the big. It was a big deal that it was coming back in brawl. No, it was in melee. Was it? I'm pretty sure. I think brawl was the one where they took it out. Alright, get to the finish. Get it. Get it. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Yeah, eat shit, not Donkey Kong. Oh no, Fox! Oh wait, that's Yoshi, I think. Yeah, it's Yoshi. Run! Race to the finish in this game is really kind of boring. Yeah, Melee, Melee definitely had the better one. And then Brawl killed it. And then I kind of hate Ultimates. Ultimates is awful. Ultimates is so bad that I regularly just run backwards and die immediately. Good luck! So, Fighting Polygon Team is the best mass team.
Fighting Polygon team is going to, uh, you are going to lose your last life here. Um, I love Fighting Polygon team because of the lack of effort. <laughs> it's just their fucking hitboxes. No, but it's so cool. Oh yeah, it's great. But it's also like, so little effort. And also, here we go, the first appearance of Battlefield. Like, why does Yoshi have teeth? No, 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 you fucking don't. Also, why does Pikachu look like a sand shrew? That's always fucked me up as a kid. Alright, next time the Pikachu polygon is up there. No, I saw it. It looks like a sand shrew. I wish they would have just brought the Fighting Polygon team back. Fighting Polygon is the best team. I hate I hate I that we got Mies again in uh, in Ultimate. Yeah. I think I think Wireframe came close. Wire like the fact that it was only two characters. Wireframe is all right. I actually like Alloys better than Wireframe. Well, same. Look out, that Pikachu has a bomb. <laughs> I stopped, Ness, you idiot. What the fuck, Donkey Kong? No. I forgot they have friendly fire on. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. See, you're you're instinctively trying to grab them while you're running. It's, it's so ingrained. Like, it feels wrong having to be at a complete stop to pick up an item now. Well, it's also my, uh, my inputs aren't 100% reliable right now. No, I'm so close. I'm so close. It's just these guys. You can do it. Oh, no! <sighs> We are on normal difficulty. Yes. Oh, no! Oh. 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 That Pokemon totally would have killed him. Unless it was a Goldeen. Oh, so close. So fucking close. Now this is now this is easy. Also, Kirby Kirby's polygon is fucked up to me. What? It's Why a, does it look like that? It's a fucking clay thing. I don't know. It's a snowman. It's like twice Kirby's actual height. And it's not like, well, the, the hitbox had to be like that, so that so that uh, attacks would hit normally. Because Jigglypuffs is normal! I do. I don't think these are literally just the hitboxes. I think they are changed up a little bit. Because uh, uh, otherwise, um, Kirby and Kirby and Jigglypuff's uh, polygon fighters would look the same. So they probably changed them up a little bit. I think it's just generic polygons uh, stretched over a while over their skeleton, their rigging. Oh yeah, well, it's, it's definitely the same like rigging and moveset and everything. 
It's fucking crazy how when you throw the star rod, they go at, like, that lower angle. We haven't seen a single fan. You know, it took until Brawl for me to realize that throwing the fan makes them go up. Just never noticed until it was pointed out on the dojo. I'm not getting any Did healing. Did that motherfucker items. just taunt? Good setup. They basically just lined up in a row for you right there. Yes, this is a good one. A good one. For this specific situation. This is back before healing items were balanced in any way. <laughs> well, no, because, like, you know, Max the Tomato uh, heals a good amount. Uh, heart container heals all. Yep, which they've been the same. It. That's true. Uh, Maximum tomato should also heal all, though, because they do that in Kirby. No, I'm saying it's bullshit because it's unbalanced. It's not fair. Well, they've always done that. They still do. That. No, they don't. Maximum yeah, does. Heart containers heal. No, they do not. Heart containers. Heart containers heal all your damage. No, they don't. They do 100. Maximum does 50 now. Huh. Yeah, I don't know if you were here when, when I was talking about, like, Smash 64 has so much shit that's just ingrained into my brain as this is how Smash plays now, and it's just not there, because it wasn't added until later. I think this is still the best uh, Master Hand fight. Music's kind of weak. I like the music, though, yeah, it, I think other uh, later entries have relatively better music. I like this music a lot. Does this music show up in Ultimate? I don't think so. That's that's unfortunate. I like this song a lot. This song gives me really strong nostalgic vibes. Oh. Fairy Bottle heals 100 HP, the heart container heals. No, Fairy Bottle holds 100 when you're... It heals 100 when you're holding it. I'm, pretty, I'm fairly confident that the heart container is still just 100. Oh. I I think Brawl still has the best original music. Well, that sucks. Uh, <laughs> Fuck. Hey, one attack and you've got him. <clears throat> First try. First try. I'm so upset. I, th I think Brawl has my favorite original music in the franchise. Um, just as a whole. But... I think the 64 is a close second for me. And then Ultimate of Wii U, I think, are, are uh, tied. I think Melee... Well, no, I think I'd put Ultimate and Melee tied, and then maybe Wii U. There's the boy! No, Crazy, Hand, Crazy Hand would not be introduced until Melee. It was just Master Hand in 64. And it should also be noted that uh, Classic Mode is the same no matter what in 64. These are the motion capture actors, I think. It's beautiful. Voice actors! Charles Martinet! Wait. Is Charles Martinet's name no. spelled wrong? Uh, oh yeah, wrong? yeah, yeah, they, yeah. No, I think they, I think they spelled it wrong. Beautiful. It's crazy how far back Bill Trinan goes.
Yeah, that's true. Uh, from melee on, every every like every original song is a remix of the same song. For the most part, I kind of like that. Yeah, I, I like that a lot, but I also think there's something to be said about, like, the credit song and Final Destination and Metacrystal and all that are completely different pieces in this game. Uh, you press A. Let's see. I don't have any control okay. whatsoever. So let's try. Let's see. Let's see if... Let's do a thing. Uh, yeah, so 64 is the only one, I believe, that has... Well, no, Melee's, uh, Melee's classic mode is also set from the start, right? I didn't play a lot of Melee, so I don't know for sure. Shit, I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to close the whole thing. Heck. What have you done? Oh, hold on. Oh, God. Pay no attention. Don't worry about it. Pay no attention. Don't worry about it. <laughs> the lag you're seeing, the players aren't <laughs> seeing that. Uh, but yeah, Melee, Melee has uh, set things, right? I sent you the thing, by the way. Uh, melee has set what? Uh, classic mode. No. Melee has, like, more or less totally random. Ah, so this is the only one uh, until Ultimate that had set classic mode. Yes. And then Ultimate did it super cool in which everybody has their own set classic mode. Yeah. I uh, I, I reached under my desk and uh, un unplugged my controller and put yours in. <laughs> oh, Okay. <laughs> As Thank we know, you. As we know, you have a. You know, you got, we, we've you got have a, to reset the. You have to reset the console when you do that. Yeah, we've got. Well, we got a very long HDMI cable. I mean, you could have just handed me the controller, but this is a lot faster. You'd have to walk all the way across the apartment. <laughs> hand it to me. Well, who's saying anything about an apartment? We got a very long HDMI cable. Well, yeah, but like, I'm in a different room. That's true. That's true. Because we yeah. we didn't want we didn't That's want true. screen cheating. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. Yeah. All right, you're, you should be player one now. I seem to be. Sick. I'm going to grab my Switch and chest t uh, check when the heart containers, uh, how much the heart containers heal in Ultimate. I'm going to play as Captain Falcon, and also I'm going to play on easy. Thank you. I'm a coward. All right, this is going to be a disaster. I might have... The last time I played was like two weeks ago to make sure that I remembered how to play Super Smash Bros. 64, uh, and then I didn't. Oh, whoops, I'm fighting an enemy in Settle Blade. Welcome. Just sort of sat and did that, huh? By the way, I don't know if you guys know this, but Xenoblade's Blade's like a 10 out of 10 game. Welcome. God, Falcon Punch is so fast in this game, though. I know, that's why I had to nerf it. It's too fast. Like, it's it's insanely fast compared to what we're used to now. It's too fast. Sixty four cap is my favorite uh, cap to play as. Don't worry, that's just that's just the stream. Players aren't seeing that. I don't know what's causing this, but so Xenoblade, uh, if you, um, it's really only grindy if you're not doing side quests. If you do all, if you do the side quests, you will actually end up over level to the point that I have turned on expert mode. Um, so that I can not have my experience apply automatically for side quests. Um, if you are, if you do side quests, then you basically don't have to grind at all because side quests give you a lot of experience.
We all like to point to that subspace emissary uh, uh, cutscene where uh, Captain Falcon genocides the Pikmin as like his first offense, but it turns out. Oh, cool, Goldine, great. She finally appeared. Show me a move. Game set. But it turns out that his first offense was actually the Yoshi's. Captain Go that way. No. Hey. I gave you a job. That way. That way! Alright. You guys ready to, to see something here? Are you putting your switch on the screen? I'm too? holding it up. Oh, I see. All right. So, how was? Does not heal all the way. Huh. I have forgotten. Everything I once knew about this break the targets course. You know who's break the targets course? I don't think I've ever seen. Who's and I will do Ness? that. Yeah, I've never seen Nesses ever. I think that you need an up air for this. Yep. Yeah, because I don't. I think that the uh, I think the up B is a it command no, grab. Yeah, it has no hitbox. It's actually just a grab. Have you seen any of that? It gave me nests too. What the fuck? <laughs> Have you seen any of that? Um, what's it called? The uh, the the Pokemon mini anime series that just got put on Netflix. I have not, but I hear good things. I haven't I watched they it recently, yet. They but I recently released an episode about Nessa, where she's uh, the cutest ever. Uh, there was a... Um, I just saw on Twitter that they got the original 4Kids Nurse Joy actress back for the dub. What the fuck? Interesting. God, there's no, uh, friendly fire there, Ness. No! No! I'm playing on easy. If I game over, it's gonna be the greatest shame of my life. Thank you, Ness. Oh, God, Ness's break the targets requires you to hit yourself with... Okay, thunder. Yeah, you gotta I mean, learn. That makes, that makes sense, but fuck. I can't do that in modern Smash. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, I gotta watch I gotta watch that anime. Also, it's on Netflix? I thought it was on YouTube. It's, uh it was it originally premiered on YouTube. It is now on Netflix. Oh. Because I, I saw a bunch of screenshots of, of Nessa in her episode, and she looked cute as shit, and now I know that I have to watch it. Yeah, the Nessa episode was a couple months ago, I think. Uh, let me check Annie list. I know it's on there. How many episodes it is. Pikachu is currently wrecking my shit. This is a great shame. Go that way. Giant Donkey Kong! 
I love it when you get DK as your as your ally against giant Donkey Kong. It's I didn't so even know you stupid. could. You sure can. Oh, damn it. I'm getting greedy. I'm trying too hard. No! There's a lot of Pokemon stuff on Annie List. There's a lot of movies. I mean, I could have that. Why the hell is Bakemonogatari showing up when I search Pokemon? Moan. I guess. Dead it! No, what did Captain Falcon sport the platforms? Yeah, Pokemon like? Twilight Wings. That's the name of the. Yeah. It's the Galar. It's the Galar one because the the actual anime didn't just go to Galar like yeah. they uh, it has, traditionally do. It has seven episodes. Oh, Ness's uh, Ness's Japanese voice is uh, Sora Ami Amamiya. She plays uh, Aqua in Konosuba. Uh, her English voice is... I watched the Konosuba, though, as did you, so... Oh, well, yeah, but I, I, I know the Konosuba the original. Let me check the voice actors for this. Fuck! I hit the wrong button! How could you do this? I hit the wrong button. I hit A instead of B. So I did an up air instead of an up B. Like a fool! Like a fool! Three, two, one, go! Uh, See, Nessa's, and then I hit B of Nessa's English voice actor, uh, she, this is her first role. Uh, her name is Anairis uh, Quinones. For the most part, these are actors that I'm not familiar with. Hey, that's good. Or like relatively newer ones. Sonya is Allegro Clark. Oh, Wispy, why? Chairman Rose is Wispy. Keith Silverstein. I did see a clip of uh, oh, what's her name? The the assistant lady. Oliana. Yeah. I saw a clip of her, like, yelling at somebody for getting the difference between Dynamax and Gigantamax wrong. <laughs> and, like, just ranting at them. And, like, at, so at some point, he's just like, okay, okay, I get it. And she's like, no, let me finish. <laughs> Takahiro Sakurai is the Japanese voice of Leon. Don't. I was looking at Samus. Why was I looking at Samus? Okay, so that background is a Super Metroid map? Apparently. I'll have to get higher to... I'm confused. Right, hold on. I don't see it. No. Oh, here! Oh, that! Right here. Oh, okay. I see it. Yeah, alright. Come get me. What? What the? What? 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 I was looking away. She walked over it! <laughs> oh, no. I've got a motion sensor bomb! She walked right over it and didn't explode! What? B is voiced by Laura Stahl, best known for the Promise Neverland dub. She's relatively new. I'm gonna need you to die. Yeah! There now it explodes! Jesus Christ. Ugh.
Ness doesn't do fuzzy pickles when he, when he taunts. I don't know what the fuck his taunt is supposed to be. He's just nodding. It should be him doing throwing up the P, the V, and doing fuzzy pickles. Isn't that one of his victory poses? Probably. I don't know. I never unlocked Ness in 64. <laughs> I have probably played as Ness in Smash 64 a total of 10 times, if that. Like, in my life, in the 20 years since this game came out. I'm hitting the wrong buttons. I'm a fool. No, go over there. That way. That way. All right, foot. That's not the direction I kicked him, but it's fine. There we go. There we go. Huh. <sighs> Do this, I, I believe still, in you. I'm still hitting the wrong button. Yeah, don't do that. I tried not to. You know what? The demons won. No, fuck off. Fuck off, not Ness. So a fun fact that well no, I'll wait till later. out that uh, this fun fact about my childhood will uh, fit better during a different section of the stream. So I am absolutely going to game over during fighting Polygon Team. There's no way I won't. But you're on easy. I sure am, and it will be a great shame. But there's also uh, a HDMI delay. <laughs> That's a real thing. Yeah. Also, All after right, the you stream. Can't, you can't turn around. That was added in. After the stream, remind me that my uh, OBS is set to 30 frames per second, and I should turn that up. I can't take any more hits. No hits. Which one of you is going to ruin it? No, Kirby! You were the, the sound chosen effect. one. The sound effect on his forward smash is so weird. Fuck. I don't even know what fucking hit. Uh, I'm ashamed. Turns out I should have been playing on very easy where the babies live. Also, I fucking love his his weird ass sound effect for his forward smash. It's, it's so dumb. It is dumb. I agree. How am I already at ninety percent? Secret to fighting Polygon is at the very least, once you once you knock them off the stage, they're basically done, except for Kirby and Jigglypuff. Because they don't get uppies. They have no recovery move. No. No. 
There's a Persona game on PC right now. There sure is. That's weird. Like, I have it. I've downloaded it. It's in my Steam library. Glad it's dropped so many fucking... See, now I'm doing it without losing any lives. No, I want this Pokemon. Thank you, Blastoise. I'll remember you! Blastoise had to return to his home planet. Ow. 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 Yo, you know what we're gonna see? We're gonna see mods, mods of Persona. Where's the mod? Okay, so the first mod I want is the one where I could play the whole game as Nanako. <laughs> This and the great thing, like, for. Persona games did have mods before, but, like, they never really took off because, you, you know, you had to mod your console. Thank you, Beedrill. You've saved me. How long until we see an original Chie voice mod? Mods in Chi uh, original Chie voice lines uh, whenever possible. Uh, don't know, and I'll never download it because Chie's original voice is rough. Ow. I was talking to Soul, and Soul likes the original voice better. Soul is incorrect, but it's fine. You missed! You can't poke me! I know that Kanji is still Troy Baker in Golden, but uh, I showed Soul the uh, the comparison between Troy Baker and Matt Mercer for Kanji, and it's just the same. Well, yeah, because both of those guys are fucking insanely talented voice actors. Have you heard that uh, Matt Mercer like actually said that he, he will never be a Troy Baker replacement again? Because he, he doesn't like just being the guy that replaces Troy Baker. Good. Persona, Persona 4 would not be the first game I have that uh, that has the Nuvo, to be honest, so. I'm not too concerned. I mean, I play Rainbow Six Siege, and that is the Nuvo anti-cheat. We've done it! I cleared it on easy. I like the I like the idea that they're action figures more than I like the trophy thing that uh, that melee and brawl. Oh yeah, they with. did they did the trophy thing because it's easier to put trophies in the game as collectibles. But yeah, they are definitely better. Yes, I am number one. I do like that this is a comic book style uh, victory screen. All right, you ready to fight? I guess. Let's fight. Stock, right? Is it three stocks? Yes. I have no idea. I'd say yes. Any items we want to turn off? Uh, none no. of the items in this game are, are particularly awful. Free for all! What? Yeah, yeah. So, one of, my, one of my least favorite things about this one is that what are you? What are you? I'm trying to do. Oh, that's you. Yeah. Oh, I'm first player now. Duh. What? What's one of your least favorite things? There's no random switch. Oh yeah. I mean that happens. So I'll tell you what. Chat. Pick who we're playing. No, let's just try all the characters. We have to pick who I play first. We've already seen Mario. Thanks says Kirby, so we're gonna play Kirby. I wanna play as how do I change my uh, C stick. C buttons, whatever. I'm using the game PP controller. Uh, I like blue Kirby. And yet there's a random stage switch. What stages have we not really seen a whole bunch of? Actually we've seen all of them except for 
Yeah, except for that one. I always wanted this Link outfit in Ocarina of Time. What is it based on? It's... I don't think it's based on anything. Is this before... is this before costumes were really based on... all the costumes were really based on anything? Yeah, for the most part. Because I know Mario has... Wario, but that's... Samus has a Gundam. That's real, by the way. I don't know if you knew that. Samus' green outfit is based on a Gundam. I did not know that. Uh, the Zaku's, specifically. Uh, the Zaku is, in, in Gundam, referred to as the mass-produced Gundam. Uh, and um, Samus' green outfit was referred to on uh, Sakurai's blog as the mass-produced color. And it's the same colors as the Zaku. Beautiful. Oh, cool, thank you. Damn it! You're welcome. Goodbye, Kirby. I'll miss you. Smash 64 is like so much stiffer. <laughs> like I, I, I can't, my actions can't, don't flow into each other at all. Fuck. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah, in 64, the hammer is basically a, an instant kill. Yeah, <laughs> I noticed. Smash 64 has my favorite victory screen, though. Which one? The, the one we just looked at. That's in all of them. No, it's not. Oh, you mean the, the like, actual aesthetic of the victory screen? Yeah. Uh... Uh, do this for Melee? Yeah. Yeah, Lord, Lord. We're, we're planning on doing this for, uh, all the games. Hopefully. Yeah, let's go here. Is this the only stage we haven't seen yet? It's weird how the colors don't actually match. Mar uh, oh, they no, they match All Stars. This, yeah, this is based off Super Mario All Stars. Hell yeah, no recovery at all whatsoever. Except for his, you know, his, his double jump. But shh, we're not talking about that. Ah, the last stage with working pipes. I mean, it's as possible as playing Smash 64 online. Which is to say it's not... Yeah, we just got a very long HDMI cable. Very long HDMI cable and our, our 64 is really old. Oh, come on. Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, that's 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 the uh, Wii Virtual Console version. The Wii Virtual Console had native GameCube controller support. That that part that part's actually real. <laughs> I didn't know that. Goodbye, Yoshi! Oh, yeah, you had you had one of the Wii's that didn't have a GameCube ports, didn't you? No, I did. Uh, ben has one that doesn't have GameCube ports. Mm, okay. Mine had GameCube ports. Yoshi looks fucking weird in this game. Yup. By the way, Link sucks. Eyes. You should try Link. He sucks. I'm gonna play as Pikachu, who's good. So I'm told. Wait a minute. Really? Wait a really? minute. That's not Pikachu's down throw. 
Oh, back in the day, got the better down throw. this is also back in the day when Luigi was just a pitch shifted Mario. And slightly taller, but only slightly. <laughs> Oh, Green of Time Link would probably be the easiest to translate into a 3D model, because, I mean, hey, they already did. Yeah, like, we, we talked about it on the, like, the past episode when we were mentioning how, like, that's the only 2D Zelda that we were playing for the show. Uh, it's because all of Zelda in Smash is essentially based on like, 3D Zelda, because those are the easiest to translate into a 3D model. Like, Zelda, Zelda is basically the first character, the Zelda character in Smash to be based on one of the, the 2D games. I think otherwise there just is no 2D Zelda in Smash at all. Very bad at Pikachu. Which, that kind of sucks, by the way, because there are some good, like, handheld Zeldas. No, there's a stage based on Spirit Tracks. That's 3D. Yeah, but it's handheld. Checkmate, atheists! I just tried to use Skull Bash. That's true, Temple is 2D Zelda. Yeah, actually, that's first time Zelda 2, that's correct. I forget a lot because it doesn't look anything like Zelda 2. <laughs> Wasn't well, this also technically supposed to be based on one of the 2D Zeldas, this stage? Now get away from me! No, this is this is pretty specifically Ocarina of Time's Hyrule Castle. Can I kill you once? Thank you. Only once. Fuck! <laughs> well. That's what you fucking get. It's like, it's like in Joker, you get what you fucking deserve. God, it's such a heavy sound effect. Yeah, it's so good, I love it. Luigi with a real ass gun. It's a laser gun still. <laughs> I don't know what I expected to happen there. Bye. Oh, are are the uh, do, are those top textures not working properly in the like they're in uh, ultimate? Have we seen a beam sword yet? No. We have. Yes, we have. We have. I, I got one bird fighting polygon team. Ah. Hmm. No, Mr. Saturn shirt. Oh, you're, Worst game. Oh, you're doing the Zaku. Oh, hey, this actually kind of looks like Earthbound. Looks a hell of a lot more like it and than it does a Vizier did. How long have we been going? Um, for like an hour and a half? 
or ex almost an exactly an hour. Yeah. Like, and when I when I say exactly an hour, I mean the clock currently reads one hour zero minutes thirteen seconds. I think a couple more, a couple more matches. Make sure we get every character on screen, and then uh, and then board some platforms. Let's board some platforms to break some targets. Ow. Hello! Welcome to the Super Smash Ow. Brothers. Get Son of a bitch! <laughs> Son of a bitch! Here's the... here's the fan. Why? She threw it over his head! <laughs> Can't beat me. The fan vanished! You destroyed it! Yeah, I don't know what the hell happened. Uh, we did actually watch the Sony livestream. There's also the PC gaming show going on right now. With Persona 4 being on PC, which I'm still kinda not over. Ness is hard. I just want to do it once. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Hold on. No, I gotta do it once. Let me do it once. <laughs> it sent well, you far in this game. Like. You did it once. <laughs> I'm proud of you. I've never been more proud of you than in this very mm. moment. The real disappointing thing for me about Persona 4 coming to Switch uh, is that it's my least favorite Persona game. <laughs> Uh, not, not Switch. No, PC. PC, yeah. Uh, well, it's a very good game, and I, I hope more Persona games follow it. We'll see. The good thing, at least, is that I it's think... it's quite an old game that was originally for an underpowered system. Pretty much any PC can probably run it, right? Well, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I would say pretty much any PC can run Persona 4 at least, right? Yeah, I would say so. Did you fucking did you fucking step Don't on your own ball? Don't worry about it. I'm pretty worried about it. Um, I neither of us have ever played one or two. Here's the thing about Persona 1 and 2. They are a different friend. They are a different okay. series. Just straight the only up. Two, the only two characters we have not played on at all yet is Jigglypuff and Donkey Kong. Donkey Kong. I'm gonna regret playing as Jigglypuff. Yeah, so like straight up, Persona One and Two, they're 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 different. They're totally different games. I have never played them, uh, and they're just they're completely different. One, so the the rumor is based. Well, not really the rumor, but as far as people understand it, uh, Atlas has a deal with Sony that says that mainline Persona games are are PlayStation exclusive and. It finally coming to a different system, and it only being PC, uh, to me, kind of confirms that is still the case. Yeah, because here's the thing. Uh, we cannot say for certain that that exclusivity deal is over, because Horizon came to PC. I think it's less Persona is no PC, longer exclusive. PC is not considered a... It is console exclusive. PC is not considered a... That was... I have no idea what the fuck that was. Uh, PC is not considered a console and therefore does not count towards console exclusivity. Yes. Uh, which was not, it's, it kind of depends on the contract specifically. Um, cause that's not, that's not a catch up. That's not a 100% consistent rule. Uh, why isn't Persona 3 and 4 on the PS4 then? Uh, cause they would need to port it. <laughs> that's kind of just the case. Um, they would just need to make ports of it. Whereas Persona 4 coming to PC, making a whole, like making a PC port, that's a huge, huge deal supporting the PC market. And it's, it would frankly get more people into the series than a PS4 port of 3 and 4. Um, because it, is, it, because it is now serving an audience that it has, oh, here we go. Uh, it is now serving an audience that, uh, it has never served before. Whereas uh, a PS4 port of three or f of three or four would be nice, 
Uh, <laughs> it's it's still fundamentally uh, serving the same market. So all right, time to board the platforms. I haven't got to play unless everyone. You want one more, unless you want one more match. I think I think I think the roster's small enough that we can like each play everyone. To be honest. Cause I'm kind of then I then I'd have to play Ness, play Link. <laughs> uh, Blood Falcon, Blood Falcon. Also, Atlas's PS4 crew oh. would have been focused on uh, Persona 4, or Persona 5. Remember the, the, the good old strat for this stage? Just camp forever? I'll wait. His get up is so slow! Link sucks, dude. He takes so long to get up! That's bull that's bullshit that you can stack both those items. Oh no, I left Facebook open. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to hear that. Oh, he doesn't have the knee. Oh yeah, the knee was a melee thing. Boomerang is neutrally, actually. Uh, the bow and arrow were added in melee. Yeah. Was it a strategy? Uh, in my heart it was. What the fuck? Bomb. The fuck was that? Why did you... Link, you're letting me down here. Link, you're letting me down here. Why didn't you jump? Link, why didn't you jump? <laughs> Link sucks in this game, dude. Uh, who else do I want to play? I've heard Pikachu's good. I believe in you. You can do this. Can I? Well, what did you think was going to happen? Uh, so, <laughs> so there's a Pavlovian response in my mind because when Electrode comes out of a Pokeball in later games, you could pick him up. So I was like, oh, gotta pick up Electrode. <laughs> So that that's what I expected to happen. <laughs> <laughs> I hit myself! <laughs> Woo! It's so much harder to recover as Ness in this game. I forgot that Chansey used that um <laughs> No, what's her name? Fucking Clefairy uses uh, metronome. metronome.
Worth. Oh. Fuck. On the whole, I'm I I don't care for Smash 64 too much, but combos do feel kind of natural in this game in a way that they don't in the rest of the series. Uh, I said during I said during the last episode that 64 was my favorite until Ultimate came out. Uh, Diddy Kong was good in in four for a while. Cloud was good. That's all I needed. Ow. Hey, did you know that that doesn't count as a as a projectile? Uh, yes. Only like energy stuff does, I think. Oh, energy stuff. You mean like electricity? Well, stuff that like carries through the air. You mean like electricity? Thank God I got one fucking kill. Be a Goldeen, I dare you! Hey, Ness, playing Ness with lag is like hell. I think actually. I, I think just. I might as well not be playing the game. I think playing Ness in 64 at all is hell. Yeah, he's not very good. Right. Ready for board the platforms? Sure. Or like target test, I don't know, we'll do one. We'll do both, actually. We got time to do both. I think I got another like 30 minutes in me. Alright. Uh, do you want to go first or should I go first? Uh, you can go first. I did the I did the last single player content. <laughs> That's some bullshit. Let me tell you. Hitting, hitting that one fucking. Okay, so I don't think it requires you to hit yourself with Pika Thunder at any point. I think it's just... It, it just might right here. It requires you to be able to control... Oh, no! Oh, you already fucked up. What do you mean I fucked up? You're supposed to hit that with Pika Fire. And then the fire would fall down onto the other. You might still be able to do it, I don't I, know. I can definitely still do it. I'm sure you're quote-unquote supposed to do it that way. Or, or. Oh, you know, fair. <laughs> <laughs> Just hit it with your foot, turns out. Who else should we do? Uh, DK. Hey. Close Facebook. I do like that DK's uh, platforms are, are red girders. DK's being one that gave me a lot of trouble as a child. Or it might have been his board the... No, it was this one because of that. Does Fuck this thing hurt me? One. No. no. Uh, so most yeah, Smash that's, most that's Smash games have that grace period where you can you can jump immediately after walking off a platform. This one doesn't. Who's next? The thing. Uh, do Fox and then I'll jump in. Or Kirby. Kirby works too. 
what the hell? Uh, what the hell? Something's up with my controller. Uh oh. Uh oh. There we go. There you go. I can't decide if I like Mail. I, I think I think I like Ultimate best. Either that or Smash Four. For aesthetic? Yes. Fuck. Oh, unfortunate. How did that not break? <laughs> All right, let me give a couple of shots. See if I can't see if I can't uh, trigger the thing that scared the piss out of me as a child. What do you mean? Probably not. What the hell scared you as a child? Fuck. Should I turn up the buffer at all? Does that help? Uh, I think it's fine. Come on. So I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna get it this time, but I'm pretty sure. Fucking Christ. I'm pretty sure I've told the I've told the story uh, on a couple of shows before, but and at least on Twitter once or twice. But uh, as a kid, when you when you uh, get a new record in Target Test or Board the Platform, fucking hell! Uh, instead of saying "complete," the uh, announcer screams "a new record!" And as a child, that scared the shit out of me the first time it happened. <laughs> Like, I'm talking... I'm talking through, like, turned off my 64 and, like, didn't play Smash for a little while after that scared the shit out of me. That's odd. Like, of all the things to scare me, right? This has some pre-baked, uh, records now, so you probably won't get new records. Oh yeah, the fucking best time for Lynx was 18 seconds, and it took me a minute. Did I just trap myself? No, we're good. <laughs> Fuck. Remember, oh 45 God. degree angle. 45 degree angles are for nerds. And also, Pikachu. Fuck. Damn it. There we go. I wanted to do it in the cool way. That's dicey. Go. 
go. Oh, the CSS start in this game is very good. Source Gaming has a video about it. But one that I would uh, recommend. What was the best time for that? 12 fucking seconds! Let's see, we haven't seen Luigi. We haven't seen Kirby. Kirby. Good old days of fat Pikachu. May he rest in peace. He's not dead, he's just a little lost right now. Not seen. We haven't seen Yoshi, Luigi, Jigglypuff. I think are it. Yoshi. I remember Yoshi's being a pain in my ass because it requires the egg. Yeah. Is there not some trick to the one there in the bottom? Bottom right? I, I believe all you gotta do is like go down and unless you can like, I doubt this is the case, but what if? Nope. Maybe like his down air really close to the ground? Nah, no, there's no way. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Next up is Snap, I think so. Pokemon Snap. Yes, next up next up is Pokemon Snap. I'm very much looking forward to that game. That'll be a one session game <laughs> for sure. Oh my god. Yoshi, walk off the edge. No! Yoshi! Uh, Unfortunate. Do you, want, do you want Luigi or Jigglypuff? Because I'll do the other one. That's up to you. Well, I'm doing Luigi, so have fun with Jigglypuff right after this. Oh yeah, Luigi's is hell. His is based on, uh, his aesthetic is based on Mario Brothers. I forgot, he has a completely different aesthetic from Mario's because Mario's is based on Donkey Kong. Also, yeah, I remember Luigi's being very hard. Why'd you pick it? Because I don't want to play as Jigglypuff. <laughs> Essentially. I don't remember how to get that one. Luigi even uses the same... The same voice clips. Yeah, they're just pitched up. Landed. Okay. 
Okay. I don't remember anything about Jigglypuffs. I've made a mistake. Yeah, um, I, I don't I know agree. how to get those. Oh, that's how. Right. Double slap. Pound. Is it pound? I've always thought it was double slap. It is pound. Why do I always think it's double slap? All right, board the platforms. So we've seen Falcon and Mario. Oh, right, Jigglypuffs is hell. I remember Jigglypuffs now. <laughs> Never thought how weird it is the Jigglypuffs in this game at all. Like legit, it's, it's, it's all cool. the anime. It's all, only in this game because she was very popular in the anime. This part is just fuck you if you don't know how to pound. You mean, did you mean me as a child? Because <laughs> I didn't. I think Foxes was my favorite. Foxes is pretty good because it's a rail shooter. Or not a rail shooter, but it's on rails. Now I remember that. Yeah, That's you, really cool. You gotta do two loops. Fuck! I may have made an error. Or not! Sick. Or there was no error made at all. Yeah, I forgot this. I forgot this was a... Well. Oh, there it is. Oh, there's multiple platforms. Oh, thank God. Once. I don't think I ever knew that. I probably knew that when I was a kid. But yeah, I never would have thought about it as a kid, but this uh, this being an on rails board the platforms uh, stage makes perfect sense. And is very cool. Not high enough, damn. It's just barely not high enough. I'll take Link. Is this the Spirit Temple? I don't know what the fuck this is supposed to be. But it is, it is laid out like a dungeon. Yeah, let's give that one another shot. Oh my god. But it is, I do think it is actually like designed to be laid out like a dungeon.
Almost. Oh, it's just barely. What was the time on that? 32? That's a lot. Okay. Let me give. Let me give. Let me give something a shot. Let's try. Okay. Sure worked out. The way it froze there. Like, hey, you want to live with your mistake forever? <laughs> Here you go. Okay, give a second. Why isn't this taunt a chest pound? How about you let the taunt answer that question? The taunt? I did the taunt at the beginning. Yeah, no, 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 no. It answers the question. I don't understand what the taunt is even has even supposed to have been for all these years. He still has that taunt. And I still don't understand what the fuck it's actually supposed to be. Uh Kirby. God. Go through the. You can't. Go through. You, you don't go through them. You're supposed to. Do you want me to tell you the solution here? Oh, I'm aware. I just keep not. I just keep hitting the wrong fucking button. There we go. Uh, oh. Nope. Yeah! Oh yeah, it goes way higher in this game. Wee, wee. 64 is so much jank. Does it really want me to go this way first? I'm, uh, well, you can go down right, and then when you get to the platform at the bottom, then you can just go under the thing. Ow. Or that. <laughs> Whee! Where are we going? Going up first. Did I miss a platform? I did not. Okay. Doesn't go that high. Yeah, that felt fake. Uh, let's see. We have seen Pikachu. Oh wait, did we see Pikachu's? No, we didn't. I don't know why this. This is reminiscent of Jigglypuff. Ah, uh, that's true. Oh, there's only one. Okay. Had to make sure. Fuck! You did it. Oh, bleed! What was the best time on that? 28 seconds? Oh, I came! No, wait, best time is 32. Alright. You did the, the targets. I'll do his platforms. His stupid, stupid platforms. Well, I think also a big part of uh, Smash 64 is that at the time it was it was a very unproven project. They probably just didn't have the development resources to do all the cool stuff that Sakurai would have wanted. So they kind of had to just make do. That's not what I wanted to hit. Jeez, it goes. Hell yeah.
sure does go over there. <laughs> Yeah! Fuck. Yeah, I really wanted you to get the fucking PK Thunder for this one. Because otherwise you weren't fucking getting up there. Fuck. Son of a bitch. Damn it. <laughs> I'm gonna get this. Son of a bitch. Let's try going on the other side. Can I? I don't have enough room to maneuver. And now I'm down here again. God, getting it, getting it straight up is fucking hard. Could be here a while. Hey. You were fucking sick. Ah. Who's left? Who else have we not seen? Uh, I think Luigi, Yoshi. That might actually be it. And Samus. All right, I got them. You got them? Yeah. No, wait. What? What did I just do? You went. To, what, you went what, what did I do? Start. What did I just do? Uh, Ness was put in because Earthbound 64 was in development. <laughs> okay. What the fuck? Uh, pause? Maybe you're supposed to go from above? Maybe. Shit, that's a movie platform. <laughs> Whoops. See, that's kind of cool. That's the only one that requires you to know how to roll. Oh! I don't Thank care. <laughs> I got it. I don't care. Uh, Yoshi? Yoshi! Yoshi and Luigi, I believe, are the only ones left. Oh, right, literally no upward momentum. Yeah, no upward momentum whatsoever. Not even the fucking paltry chicken shit amount we get now. on the other side of the wall too no it's the same one. Oh, oh, they're going in a loop okay i see ah! There you go. Hey. 
Red Yoshi. <sighs> yeah, Red Yoshi. That's that. Red Yoshi. Everybody knows that Red Yoshi's better at board of the platforms than than, uh, than Green Yoshi. It's the power it's of a Amazon. proven, a proven fact. Yoshi's a fuck. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing fucking Yoshi's before this stream ends. The fuck I am. This is as much as I need to see to know that I don't wanna. How do I not remember this one as a kid? Is this one supposed to be in? Oh my. Well, hey. You might as well. You might. You basically did it. Is that what's supposed to be indicative that there are, of the fact that there are only two good Yoshi games? <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> As it sucks, because so do most Yoshi games that aren't those two Yoshi games. Thing. Oh god, what is my controller doing? This is the last one. We're almost we're almost free and in the clear. else in this game worth seeing there's there's nothing else in this game literally anything that's else. it uh, that's everything characters all right you can look at these although best known as the mustachioed plumber who battles the turtle tribe with his distinct jumping action this internationally famous hero has also acted as a referee a driver and even a doctor he's been linked to princess peach of mushroom kingdom for years but to this day their true relationship remains a mystery joe Though often hidden in his older brother Mario's shadow, Luigi is, in reality, very popular. Taller than Mario, Luigi also jumps higher, though although he didn't appear in Super Mario 64, in Mario Kart 64 he performed to the best of his ability. <laughs> For one who seems to always be in the background, he has many fans who eagerly await his appearance. Donkey Kong and Mario started out as arch-rivals but they've patched things up in recent years. These days, DK spends his time searching the, the jungle for bananas instead of kidnapping beautiful maidens. In the past few years, other members of the Kong family have cashed in on DK's fame as well, including his favorite nephew, Diddy. Uh, and bet you'd, bet you'd love to see him in a, video, in a Super Smash Brothers game. Oh my god, it's Ty. <laughs> this was also before DK64 came out. This is before DK64 came out, by a couple years. Link is the valiant boy hero of the Legend of Zelda series, in which he fights against the evil Ganon to retrieve, to recover the Triforce. Though his tools may change with each adventure, his strength and righteousness remain constant. With his trusty sword and a variety of weapons, he takes adventure head on. Samus Aran is the toughest bounty hunter in the galaxy. Using a special suit powered by the, by the technology of the Bird People, which allows her to execute daring acrobatic feats, Samus pursues the airborne life form Metroid throughout the universe. Why does she get so little? Yoshi gets a bigger paragraph <laughs> than she does! Yoshi is the friendly dinosaur of Yoshi's Island. He began as Mario's partner, but has since built his own identity, doubt, and now appears in many games he's bearded like three up to this point. Oh well, yeah, there's, there's all of them. <laughs> he was in he Mario was in 64, Mar technically. He was in Mario Kart. That's true. He, he does By the way, this is every Mario game Kart. Samus has ever been in at this point. Yeah. He does briefly show up in Mario 64, that is true. He uses his unique ability to turn whatever he swallows into an egg as his foremost attack. Yoshis come in a rainbow of colors and are said to have a high IQ from a very early age. The 8-inch high Kirby hails from a distant, peaceful star. Like his simplistic appearance, he is an easy, easily understood character. True to his instincts, Kirby eats when he gets hungry and sleeps as soon as he grows tired. Nevertheless, Kirby remains a formidable opponent. 
In addition to his distinct flying and swallowing skills, he has the ability to copy enemy attacks for ever-changing action. Following in his dead father's footsteps, Jesus Christ. As the young leader of the Star Fox team, Fox McCloud's piloting of the super high performance combat ship, Arwing, for the Lilation system is still fresh in our memories because it happened two years ago. His one weakness may be his difficulty earning the trust of his teammates. Pikachu, the mouse Pokemon. Height, 1 foot 4 inches. Weight, one, uh, thir 13 pounds. When several of these Pokemon gather, their electricity could cause lightning storms. Pokedex excerpt. It is literally just copy pasted from Yellow's Pokedex. Uh, the balloon Pokemon with the big round eyes. It sings a soothing melody, sending those that hear it to sleep. When mad, it puffs itself up. As a balloon Pokemon, its body is light, weak, and easy to knock away. A regular pilot in the Great Galactic Race F Zero Grand Prix, Captain Falcon is skilled at collecting prize money. Much about his past remains hidden in shadow, but it's clear that many a villain hold a powerful grudge against him. Ness was a seemingly average kid from Wanet, but in truth, he was destined for much more. When a strange meteorite landed near his hometown, the little boy with psychic powers set out to save the world. Little has been said of Ness's character, and much remains hidden, and also his game sucks. I editorialized that part. Yep. <laughs> that's so, all of yeah. them. That's Super Smash Bros. 64. It, uh... It's good. And it, it got us to where we are now. What's our ending theme? Here we go, here we go. Ready? Just pick a random number. Or, or this works too, honestly. So, hope you all enjoyed the stream. It was fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, uh, we'll be recording a special episode on Super Smash Bros. 64. It probably won't be that long, to be perfectly honest. Uh, and we'll get that out, hopefully, relatively soon. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be here on Thursday... I'll probably actually be here on Thursday. Yeah, who's with, who's uh, streaming on NWR? Uh, I figured I was. Okay. I can I can go ahead and do it. I was I'm pretty sure that I signed myself up to stream the next three games on NWR. So. What even are? Put, what even is after Pokemon Snap? After Snap is Donkey Kong 64 followed by Kirby 64, which are both two games I played a lot of as a child. Oh, we've got a guest for Kirby 64. We like, do. That's a secret. Uh, so, yeah, on, um, on Thursday, I think I will probably be back here with Pokemon Snap. We will be 100% completing the game in one night. Uh, how long to beat says four and a half hours. I bet you money I could do it faster than that. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, you know... Uh, and then from there, we're in my house after that, baby. Uh, so, hope everybody uh, joins for that. Uh, if we don't do Snap this Thursday, it will be next Thursday, but it'll probably be this Thursday because I'm itching to play Pokemon shouldn't, Snap, to be perfectly honest. Shouldn't I stream Pokemon Snap on, uh, on NWR because the game after that is, as you say, your house? I mean, I'm not against you streaming Pokemon Snap on NWR if you want to. You know what? I've been streaming a lot on NWR. Maybe it is your turn. <laughs> well, yeah, you just finished Ocarina. You yeah. did all of Ocarina. Yes. <laughs> so, it, it, yeah. Uh, DK64 would be your turn if not for the fact that that's my house. <laughs> um... And also, Kirby 64 is also kind of my house. I like Kirby uh, 64. I did, I, did, I did sign you up, but, but I like Kirby 64 a lot. A lot. We'll, we'll see. Maybe it can, I'm, maybe I'm, maybe we can con our guest into it being their house. Maybe. We'll have to see. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, going to be a fun time. I'm looking forward to playing Pokemon Snap. I haven't played it in years, so it's going to be good good thing so please join us for that uh also on wednesday i will be uh streaming 
um, a game called Coffee Talk for independent study. Uh, that ought to be fun, I think. So look forward to that. At some point soon, I want to start my own weekly stream, but I don't know when it'll be. I'm thinking of I'm, find out. what I've been thinking of. Let me. What do you think of this? Sa a Saturday morning stream. Start at like 10 a.m. in the morning. On Saturdays. I, I also considered doing a stream like that at some point, where like uh, I was gonna call it Whooper Mug, where I would put a drink in my Whooper Mug and then. So yeah, I think that uh, idea has legs. I Sick. think you should definitely go for that. Saturday morning streams it is. We just need a catchy title and then we can do it. Maybe it starts next week. Maybe. You'll have to keep an eye on the Nintendo World Report Twitter for that. But yeah, that's that's it. It's uh, Wednesday, Thursday, maybe Saturday. We'll see. That's all I got. All right, then. I will see all of you later. Make sure you keep an eye on everything Joe just said. Farewell. Bye, everybody.